good and pleasant it is when God's people live together in unity. Psalms 133 verses 1. Hello friends, today I'll be sharing my views on how to have a well-knit and strong family. Romans 12 18 says, if it is possible, as far as it depends upon you, live at peace with everyone. Although families all over the world have transformed greatly over the past few decades in terms of the structure as a result of global trends and changing demographically, the United Nations still recognizes family as the basic unit of society. As sensible citizens, it is our duty to create an opportunity to promote awareness about the importance of families and to increase the knowledge about socio, economic and demographic processes affecting them. This can be done by inspiring a number of series about the event raising events. Many countries provide an opportunity to highlight different areas of interest and importance of families. This can be done by workshops and conferences, TV and radio programs, newspaper articles and cultural programs related to the relevant themes. Families were created by God, but all families are not the same. But still, we all can try to be strong, godly families. It is written in Acts 16, 31 to 34. And they said, believe in the Lord Jesus Christ and you will be saved, you and your family. And they spoke the word of the Lord to him and all who were in his house. And he took them the same hour of the night and washed their wounds. And he was baptized at once, he and all his family. Then he brought them up into his house and set food before them. And he rejoiced along with his entire family and he had believed in God. Our families bring us joy, happiness and strength especially when the things are going great. But what about the times when there is tension between the members of the family? How do you stay strong when the things are falling apart? Here is the answer. God has given us instructions how to love and respect each other, how to communicate with each other and how to have complete faith in Him. He teaches us how to have a complete relationship, a good relationship and a good bond, strong bond with our children from the beginning and how to walk righteously on his path. Keeping the family in prayer, spending quality time with the family and knowing how to forgive all the wrongs of the family members are the key points to have a blessed and strong godly family. May the Almighty bless you and your family abundantly. If you liked my video, please like and share it and also subscribe our channel. Thank you.